Hey everyone, it's Julie and welcome to your travel friendly cardio workout. Today we are going to be working Tabata style. So what that means is you have really short work periods, but you also have really short rest periods. So we will work for 20 seconds and then we'll rest for 10 seconds. We will repeat each round four times and each round has four exercises. Are you ready to do this? We're also gonna end with a little core work. You do not need any equipment, just a little bit of space. This will all be low impact. So are you ready to have fun and get sweaty? Okay, let's get warm and let's do this. Step touch. So we're gonna warm it up just a little bit right here and then we'll jump into the workout. And so this is just something you could do anywhere. No equipment, just a little bit of space. If you wanna just get a little bit of cardio in but you don't wanna spend a lot of time, this will be a short, fun workout. Now let's take it to a heel dig front. There we go. Now the thing with Tabata is it's meant to be high intensity, not necessarily high impact, but high intensity. Because your work periods are only 20 seconds, you're gonna give me everything you've got for 20 seconds. And you're gonna rest for 10 seconds to get ready to do it again. Okay, we're gonna do a little touch out and reach overhead, here we go. So during the work periods, I need you to give me all the effort you have, everything you have. And then when that 20 seconds is up, you're gonna rest. And then you're gonna do it again. You can do anything for 20 seconds at a time, right? Yeah. Okay, reach it across. Get the heart rate up a little bit and hold it in the middle. And we're just gonna lean side to side. Stretching out the legs a little bit. You're not really going into a squat or anything. We're just doing a little leaning side to side, getting a little stretch in the inner thighs. Hold it here and then rotate, push the heel down. Let's get a little calf stretch. And come back forward, lean side to side. And we're gonna hold it. Rotate, push that heel down. Awesome, come back up. We're gonna do some little kicks to the front. Just working on the little mobility here in the hips. Doesn't matter how high you kick the leg. I just want you to kick it to the front, stretching out the hamstrings, getting some little motion going in the hips. One more on each leg. and just a little bit of jog in place. Okay, so we're gonna go into round one. You've got four exercises, 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. We're gonna repeat it four times. It's gonna go fast. Just be ready, it's gonna go fast. Okay, let me show you quickly what we're doing so that you know the exercises as they come. First one is a side step and reach. Side step and reach. So I want you to take a big side step or as big as you can in the space you have. Lift up onto your toes for a calf raise, okay? That's the first exercise. Then we're gonna go to triple step. We're just doing little steps back and forth. Now, this is pretty low impact. If you need to keep it even lower, you can be here, okay? Easy, you got this. Then we're gonna do a squat kick. So you're gonna squat, kick it out. Squat, kick it out. If squatting is no for you, then I just want you to focus on the kick to the front and you can just take out the squat. Last one will be a skater. Big step, cross the foot back. Okay, those are your four exercises. Once we get going, it's on. All right, it's on, it's intense. I need you to give me everything you have for those 20 seconds. Everything you've got. Then you get a 10 second rest. You go on to the next exercise. Everything you got, okay? Got the drill here, everything you got. You're giving me all your energy. Get a quick sip of water, let's be hydrated. I will tell you which exercises are coming, so don't panic if you didn't memorize what I just showed you. Okay, one side of your space, keeping a bend of the knee for those side steps. Here we go. And reach, and reach. Big step and lift. And rest. 10 seconds, we're going into the triple step with or without that full feet. Take it 
deep breath. Here we go, triple step. And you just have a little bit of hold to let me up. We're light on our feet, okay? So we're not like jamming our feet into the ground, not running hard, it's just a little fast step. And rest for 10 seconds. Squat kick. Use your heart rate up there. <laughs> Make sure you're not gonna kick anything around you. Let's go. Squat and kick. You can take out the squat and just do the kick. Light on your feet, little steps, or you can be here. Pulling the knee up, okay? That's your option too. Rest. In 10 seconds, squat kick, or just the kick. Take a deep breath, how's your heart rate? Mine's up there. Here we go. Squat, kick. here and rest okay we've got the skater and then we're gonna be halfway through this round see it goes up fast here we go skate it out reach that arm across pretend like you're a speed skater you're in the Olympics right now you're gonna give it all you got to win the gold. And rest. Okay, we're back to the top. Side step, lift. Catch your breath. That's what the 10 seconds are for. Catch your breath. Here we go. You got this. Are you giving me everything you got? Are you digging deep? And rest. 10 second rest. We got the triple steps. You can grab a sip of water in those 10 second rests also. So if you need water, do it. Here we go. Triple step, triple step. On your feet, working on agility. You got this. Five more seconds here. And rest. Okay, we're going to the squat kick. Are you ready? Let's do it. Squat, kick it out. Make sure that squat, you still keep your chest lifted. You're not folding in half. You're sitting in a chair. Now you're gonna kick the door closed. Man, someone forgot to shut the door. Boom. Rest to the skaters. Catch your breath. 
Here we go. Okay, we just have to go through that entire step one more time after this. Okay, I told you this goes by fast. And rest. Okay, so back to the top one last time. Then you're gonna get a one minute break and we'll go over the next round. Step touch and lift. Ready, let's do it. Okay, last time through these four exercises. Give me all you've got. You know the moves, dig deep, and now do the moves, okay? All the energy into each part of that move. And reach, you've got goals, go. Rest, 10 second rest. We got triple step. Hot ground, and we get over it like that, okay? Triple, hot feet, here we go. Hot feet, keep them moving. You're on a nice sandy beach, and the ground is hot. You gotta move. Keep those feet going. Rest. Squat kick. Okay, so we're done the last two moves of this round. Deep breath. Ready? Here we go. Squat it out. Keep it closed. And it doesn't matter how high you kick your foot, okay? Don't worry about that, just energy. Rest. Okay, skaters. Skaters for the last time. Are you ready? Let's go. Last exercise in this round, we're moving on. You got this. Five more seconds here. Dig deep and rest. Okay, friends, get a sip of water. Round one is done. All right, we got a quick rest. Let me show you your next four moves. Okay, here's what you got. You're gonna come down, reach with a little rotation. Down, reach with a little rotation. If you don't want that little squat, then I just want you to give you the rotation, okay? Then we get tight jacks. You're touching out, arm goes across. Okay, so we're just switching our feet out side to side. Then we're gonna go into jacks, low impact jacks. Okay, right here. Last one. I know this will be some of your favorites. It's fast feet. Out and in, okay? Now, it's not jarring out and in. It's light on your feet, light on your feet. If that's too much, march. In and out, it's gotta be fast. Okay, it's gotta be fast. Those are your moves. Those are the four moves, same pattern. 20 seconds on, 10 second rest, four times through. Okay, we go in 10 seconds. Are you ready? Well, actually now it's five seconds. Are you ready? We start with that squat, rotational reach. Let's go. Okay, when you rotate, do you have that core engaged? Yeah, you do. You know that's what we do here. We engage the core. Rest. Okay, touch outs. So you're just reaching across, touching your foot out. Are you ready? Here we go. Touch it out. Lighten your feet, keep a bend in the leg, and bring that arm across. The speed at which you do that, totally up to you. And rest. Okay, we got low impact jacks. You're gonna shoot those arms up. We're going for it. Are you ready? Here we go, jack it out. Now you can also do your jacks with your arms making a big sweep or just shooting them straight up. Totally up to you, does not matter. Everyone do with your arms. Honestly, just get them moving. Rest. Light on your feet. You should be like on the balls of your feet, not your toes. Okay, ready? 
Here we go, out and in. Just fast little feet, that's it. Out and in, light. We're on quicksand, we gotta move quick. Marching in and out, if you really wanna do that, that's cool. This should be really low impact, honestly, because my feet aren't really leaving the floor much at all. Rest. Okay, we're back to the top. Squat, rotational reach. You know, you've done it all now, one through. Ready? Here we go. Reach, reach. You gotta get something that's way up on that shelf, and you gotta reach for it. And you're just coming down in the middle for a little squat. You're like reloading to go again. Rest. I'm telling you, fast. We're fast. Touch out. Ready? Here we go. Touch it out. Touch it out. Sweep across. Pretend there's like a table or countertop right in front of you, and you're just gonna sweep your arm right across the top of it. And your feet just go side to side. Rest. Okay, jacks. Let's switch up the jacks. Let's do little rope arms with our jacks. Okay, here we go. So pretend you're twirling the rope while you're jacking your feet. That's the one cool thing about jacks. You can do all sorts of arms. Pull that rope. It's a ghost rope, you can't see it, but you never trip on it. Rest. Okay, fast feet. Fast feet. Are you ready? And go. Out and in, light on your feet. Bending in your knees, but keeping the chest lifted. And it's just as quick as you can. Little bitty movements, little bitty movements. Okay, working on a little speed and agility here. Which we tend to get uh, not as good at as we get older. So this is a way for us to practice and stay up on having some agility. It's important. Rest. Okay, we're halfway through the room. Two more times through these exercises. So we're back to the top. Let's squat. Rotational reach. Here we go. Reach. Reach. Now when we do these high to low sort of moves where we go down and go back up, that really gets the heart rate going. So give me your effort here. This is how we're getting that heart rate up. Working on the cardiovascular system here, making the heart strong. Rest. We got touch outs. You can do this. Ready, here we go. Touch it up, touch it up. And rest. Okay, we got jacks. So this time for our jacks, let's do a little lateral arm raises, okay? Or anything you want. Ready? Here we go. Just as long as you keep moving. Almost there. And rest. You know what's next. Fast feet. Fast feet, friends. All right, here we go. Hop in. Fast little feet. Fast little feet. Don't worry if anything's jiggling, it don't matter. Nobody's watching. And even if they are, who cares? We all jiggle. Well, whatever. No big deal. Rest. Okay. <clears throat> One more time for You ready? Let's do it. Down and reach. Give me what you got right here. Go for it. Reach for it. And rest. Okay, we got those touch-ups. Catch your breath. 
Ready, here we go. Touch it out. Squeeze those arms across. push it out in front of us, okay? We're pushing away excuses. Ah, yes. Okay, are you ready? Here we go, push it out. Those things that we let come into our minds that tell us we don't wanna do something or we've got too many reasons why we can't, boom, push those away. Focus on the reasons you can get something done, not reasons why you can't. Okay, there's no can't here. And rest. Fast feet, one last time, one last time. Ready, and go, lighten your feet. Lighten your feet. Out and in, can you go a little quicker? Oh, let's do it, a little bit faster, a little bit faster, a little bit faster. You got this, you got this, five more seconds here. You gotta squat, step out. Step it out, step it out. Now, if you don't wanna squat, which is totally okay, I just want you to step it out, step it out. So kind of like a little touch to the side. Then we got power knees. So 20 seconds will be on one leg, then we'll rest. 20 seconds will be on the other leg, okay? So we'll focus on one leg at a time. Then we got a little boxer jog. You're gonna punch as you just shuffle your feet. Okay, those are your four moves. So you've got squat, step out, or you can touch it out, okay? Totally fine, as long as you give me a lot of energy. Power knees, left and right, right and left, whatever way you want to start, doesn't matter, and a little boxer drop. Take deep breath, rehydrate. You're gonna do this, we gotta go for it. Hold your heart rate. Mine's really high. Okay, this is our last, our last cardio, and then we're gonna end with a little core. Here we go. And out. Got this. Step it out. Step it out. And just sit on down. Rest. Okay, power knees. Power knees. Pick one side. I don't care what side you start on. Make sure you got the weight and the standing leg. Here we go, power knee. And you're just gonna bring that knee up. Pull the core in. Rest. Woo! We're gonna do the same thing to the other side. Power knee, core is in. Chest is open, shoulders are down. Here we go, power knee. Now the speed you go, totally up to you. So if you need to slow this down, that's fine, but I need you to give me everything you've got, okay? Whatever it is for you. Woo, rest. Okay, we got boxer jogs with little bitty punches. Ready? Jog it out. Okay, and it's really just like transferring your weight from foot to foot and punching to the front. Okay, that's it. You got this. And if you wanna be here, just touching, you can. Rest. That feels awkward for me, I can't do that, I have to. <laughs> I have to like shift my weight back to forth. Okay, we're back to the top. Squat, step out. Here we go. Step it out. Step it out. Sit on down. Sit on down. You can also be here and just stepping it up. That's totally fine. Or pick a totally different exercise you'd rather do. That's cool too. This is your workout. Rest. We got power knees. Whew. Sweat's dripping in my eye. 
It's serious. Are you ready? Here we go, power me. Keep moving. Pull that knee up. Pull that core in. Get a little crunch here. Rest. Do the same thing to the other side. Take a deep breath. My heart rate is pretty up there. What about yours? Here we go. Move those, and move that knee as fast as you can. Go, go, rest. Okay, boxer dog, little jabs. This is where you can work out your aggression. <laughs> Something's stressing you out, just jab it up. Here we go. That's the one thing I'll say. Exercise for me, probably more mental health than anything else, to be honest. It's where I deal with stress. Because doing that workout, you don't have to think about anything else. Concentrate on the moves you're doing. Having good form, getting stronger. Your problems slip away for that time. Rest. At least they do for me. Okay, back to the top. Squat step out. Here we go. There's also that workout high that you get. You got endorphins running through your body. And it actually does improve your mood. It's also, exercise has been known to help fight depression. Just saying. Rest. Okay, we're back to power knees. Are you ready? Here we go. You can do this. We're almost done with the cardio section. We're hanging in there. We're getting it done. Rest. Okay, we're gonna do the other knee. Ooh, the sweat, you guys, it's for real. It is for real. Okay, plant that foot. Let's go. Rest. Okay, we've got the boxer jog. Little jabs. Then we just have to go through this one more time. Cardio will be done. A little quick core will be done. Here we go. Jump it up. Just right in front of you. And I'll see, I'm just switching from foot to foot. Like nothing too huge. If you want to march, you can do that too. Rest. Okay, back to the top. One more time through everything. Then we're gonna hit the core very quickly and then we're gonna be done. Let's go. Squat it out. It's your last time through. Okay, tell yourself that. It's the last time I'm gonna give it my absolute all. If I was holding back in the past for the last round, not right now. I wanna finish strong. Every ounce of energy that I can pull out, that's what I'm gonna get right now. Okay, power knees. Power, power knees. Let's focus on that power. Let's dig deep, here we go. Power. Almost there. Rest. Okay, power knees the other direction. You can do this. Okay, ready, power, go, go. Rest. Okay, fast feet, last cardio drill. Take a deep breath. 
catch your breath. Here we go. Fast feet. In and out. No, it's not fast feet. It's boxer dogs, you guys. My goodness. I was all excited to do fast feet. And you were probably like, what? <sighs> you guys, that's the thing. Being a trainer, she still make mistakes. I wanted to do fast feet. I'm really sad about that. Let's boxer jog. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Almost made you do fast feet again. <laughs> Rest. Okay. <laughs> Where is it in the water? Oh. You guys, has your brain ever just gone out the window? Yeah. Okay, where's your heart rate at? Check it. Okay. Take a deep breath. We're going to do quick. I'm going to do me quick. Little core burnout. All standing. Okay. What well, we're going to do 30 seconds per exercise. Okay. We're just gonna go through one time. And this is just gonna be a quick, let's get that core in there, done, and we're out of here. So we're going to do a standing crunch, okay? Now, 30 seconds of work, we're gonna rest for 10 seconds. Here we go, standing crunch. And I just want you to bring your elbow to your knee, and you're thinking, about closing the distance between the bottom of your ribs and the top of your hips. Rest. Okay. Now, what I want you to do, hand behind your head. You're going to reach down, come up. Hit your knee. Okay, we'll do one side, then the other. Are you ready? Here we go. Reach down, come up, elbow to knee. Reach down, come up, elbow to knee. So we got a little side bend, a little oblique twist. is engaged every part of the movement and we're going through these a little on the quick side so it's kind of cardio abs rest okay we're gonna do the exact same thing to the other side so other arm up other arm on the side and you're just really trying to reach towards your knee but you're using the core here here we go reach elbow to knee exercise left and rest okay this last one little bend to the knees arms right here <clears throat> we're just gonna rotate I really need you to use the core for this okay so you're just gonna rotate and stop rotate and stop here we go rotate stop rotate stop so you gotta put the brakes on in the middle and I just need you to use your core So you're controlling that movement right there, right in the middle. And rest. Oh, there's a spider. Let's kill him. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, there's a spider. Let's kill him. Okay. That's it. Oh my gosh. Who else is drenched? I am drenched. It's like it's pouring everywhere. Okay, take a step touch. We're gonna cool you down real quick. You're done. You're done. That was fast paced. <laughs> and um, that was hard work, right? Did you work hard? I mean, how hard you worked was totally up to you. I'm drenched and I'm tired, so I know I worked hard. Let's just lean side to side, just like we did in the beginning. And hold it here and just sink back a little bit, get the inner thighs. and then rotate and push that heel down. All right, come back. 
Let's hold to the other side. Just hold it here. We're gonna get a little bit of that inner thigh. And rotate. Push that heel down. Thank you for joining me today. I hope that you had fun. I hope that you are sweaty and you just feel good. Come back and redo this workout anytime you just want. Quick, fast paced cardio. So <laughs> get you drenched in sweat. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And if you can, give this video a like. And that's how I know you guys like it. And comment down below and tell me how you did. Was this hard? Did you love it? What did you think of the standing core? With anything you want to tell me, share your wins with me. I would love to hear them. Go have a wonderful day and I'll see you in the next workout. Bye.